Three, I am here. Killer underscore 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 B. Thank you for following. <laughs> Two lords, vile. Um, y'all keep this. The Ballister? Ballister? Thank you for following. Oh, not good. I mean, it doesn't hurt me that bad, but... I'm not 100% sure what that means this deck is. Okay, well. I mean, I'm a white through vile it is. I know I love all of my followers. <laughs> this is MTGO. I'm not sure that Cockatrice is legal, necessary to stream. Maxter Blaster, thank you for following. Endless one. How is X equal three? Uh, oh, this taps for two, and it's not two X, it's X. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. So we could smash the temple, or we could cut them off color. I think cutting them off a color is better. But not necessarily. But I, I gotta play Spreading Seas now, I think. I think I have to hurt them that way. I have no idea what they're doing. Which is... Interesting. And scary. <laughs> Hit in color. Um, so my other option was to play Silver Gill Adept to build a board. Uh, but it wasn't going to stop Endless One, and I need to... Oh, it's, so they're just an Eldrazi something deck. Interesting. Huh. And I thought that cutting them off color was maybe a better choice. We will find out. I got another Silvergill, so we will do that. Because we need to hopefully draw into a land. Yeah, I I know now, like, if they're going to be just Eldrazi Tribal, which I didn't know from Cavern of Souls, um, the color doesn't matter too much. But it could stop Bolt and things like that. But I really don't know what we're doing. <laughs> You think they're going to be going for infinite colorless mana? Um, you've seen this deck. Basically, Blight Herder into Ulamog. Okay. Um, no. We want to keep this on two. Ah, text messages. Alright. Seriously? Alright. So what are we going to do this turn?
grab my other lord. Hopefully set this up so I can win the race. Yeah, a chalice on their side of the field is pretty bad for us. But it's cool. I mean, I guess it's an Eldrazi combo slash maybe aggro deck something. I mean, it's definitely tribal. It's a 3-3. He can come three still. No bumps. Okay. Um, we want to animate the Muta Vault. We want to double and have another Lord. So we got all this Island Walk damage coming through. Actually, just copying the Lord and then swing with the Muta Vault. Or even just swing with the Muta Vault, actually. Alright, well. We'll start with that. What? Oh my god. <laughs> well, I guess I'll play Silvergill now. Oh, I can't play Silvergill. I can Violin, so I guess I'll play Phantasmal. What is happening? Cancel, cancel, what is happening? I cannot believe I clicked through that. That's really bad. Yeah, I'm probably overextending into a wrath. I don't know. I'm frustrated that I missed that attack. And luckily we won anyway. But I had them. I had them that turn. Okay, so... I don't think Pierce is going to be what we're looking for. I think Snag will help. Dismember might with some of these smaller ones. Chalice isn't going to help. Mage won't help. Siege won't help. Has us at 61. What are we going to pull out? I did accidentally skip combat. It was really embarrassing. Damnation post board, so I definitely need to not do what I did last time. Um, let's see, we're going to be on the draw. Let's plot a curse catcher. Cavern into Vile. Oh, this is slow. Tech Edge might have been good. Um, okay, so we Cavern into Vile, then we get a whole bunch of two drops. I think I think we can actually keep this. It's fast if we draw lands. It's slow if we don't. Because then we only get one guy per turn. Thank you, Sir Sreyas. Or Sreyas, maybe? <laughs> okay. Am I not hitting the right button? Oh, we did draw another land. Okay. So, Merfolk and Aether Vial. So that that means that our deck is our hand is going to be very quick. Yes, please. Oh, okay. That's enough. Thanks. Alright. So, 
We're going to throw down Silvergill. We'll show Lord Volantis, I guess that's fine. We're going to Violet in next time. Ooh, and an image! This is fantastic! Oh my goodness. Yeah, we're going to make sure we play both Retrees and we just get free Lords forever. We can untap Vial and just keep Violing and then stuff. Whew, it's going to be fantastic. Alright, well, it's their turn now. Okay. I got my card offer. Could be worse. Cavern of Souls on their side of the field. We don't have one drop in our hand, so... Yes, please. Um... I guess we go ahead and wander wine. Show the same lord. Blue, 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 Redry. And we're gonna instep pin, file in lord on on their instep. Ha! <laughs> That's really funny, Killer Caterpillar, and I think you are correct. She's pretty sweet. <coughs> Instep pen. What are we doing? What you doing? Colagons come and destroy target artifact, deals two damage to target creature or player. Hmm. Well, I can't copy the read jury now, because the read jury won't be there when it resolves. Uh, so we'll go ahead and throw in... I mean, I can't stop it, so fine, that, but that sucks. Uh, okay, yes, I want to use its ability. Where am I at? Oh, putting a two drop out. Lord of Atlantis. Okay, so we can double Lord and hit. I think that's the plan. We're faster than them. I'm not sure that this deck is, is solid enough. Okay. I'm not too worried about that. I mean, sure, it sucks, but I'm not that worried about it. Ooh, now I'm not going to copy whatever big guy they put in. Endless one for four. Okay. So I get endless one for two. Oh, goody. We'll play that, and then next time we'll be able to attack with it. And if we desperately have to for some weird reason, we can block with it. Attack! Thank you. So now if you even blocks it, they just get eaten. Yay! Yeah, I don't know what they're trying to do. 